We're often asked why Tyndale makes the investment to conduct full-scale arc flash <laughs> and flash fire in the real world. And the answer is simple. Flame resistant and arc rated clothing can be a life and death difference. And seeing is believing. <laughs> seeing these materials perform in the real world is vital to understanding why you need them. The significant majority of fatalities and catastrophic injuries in flash fire and arc flash are not caused by the initial hazard. They're caused by flammable clothing igniting and continuing to burn. And that's an entirely avoidable issue. Don't wear fuel. Wear flame resistant or arc rated clothing and avoid the catastrophic injury and fatality. To understand this better, we need to take a little bit of a deeper dive into the medical aspects of body burn. The main predictor of survival is TBSA, or total body surface area, receiving second or third degree burn. What they have in common, second and third degree burn, that makes them the same is that they both break the skin. When you break the skin, you have an infection path, and they rush you off to the hospital or the burn center, where there are more infectious agents than anywhere on earth, including all the antibiotic resistant ones. So the greater percentage of your skin surface that's broken open, the more likely you are to get that infection and the longer you're in the hospital around those infectious agents. So the goal of arc rated and flame resistant clothing is to minimize or eliminate second and third degree burn and make sure that you survive. In this exposure, to illustrate the difference between flame resistant clothing and non-flame resistant clothing, we've placed two mannequins shoulder to shoulder in the same flash. The mannequin wearing the navy blue is in flame resistant protective apparel, and the mannequin wearing khaki is in flammable cotton. Here comes our propane release, we'll zoom in a little bit for a better look. Here comes our flash. And as the mannequins emerge from the flame, the FR garment has done its job, but the flammable garment is clearly fully engulfed in flame. Here's the rear view in slow motion and zoomed in. And you can see as the flame front moves from your right to left, as soon as there's separation, you can clearly see that the flammable garment is already on fire from head to toe. This is as stark a comparison as you'll ever see. Two garments shoulder to shoulder, one flame resistant and one not. The flammable garment ignition would result in catastrophic or fatal injury, while the flame resistant garment not only has not ignited and continued to burn, it has also insulated to the hazard so that we would predict no burn through it. This is literally the difference between going home or going to the hospital, the burn center, or the morgue. So why does Tyndale make this investment in research? Because you matter and your people matter. And we are more than a service provider. Tyndale is more than a garment provider. We are your partners in safety. We do the research and share the video because seeing is believing. If you believe in it, you're more likely to wear it, to wear it properly, to take care of it, to retire it from service. And at the end of the day, if you take care of it, it'll take care of you.